10, 1 through 16. At Caesarea, there was a man named Cornelius, a centurion of what was known as the Italian cohort. A devout man who feared God with all his household. They belonged generously to the people and prayed continually to God. About the ninth hour of the day, he saw clearly in a vision an angel of God come in and say, Cornelius, and he stared at him in terror. What is it, Lord? And he said, your, your prayers and your alms have ascended as a memorial before God. And now send men to Joppa and bring one, Simon, who is called Peter. He is lodging with one Simon the Tanner, whose house is by the sea. But when the angel of the Lord, who spoke to him, had departed from him, he called to him two of his servants and a devout soldier of among those who attended him. And having related everything to them, he, he sent them to Joppa. The next day, as they were on their journey and approaching the city, Peter went to the housetop to pray. And he became hungry and wanted something to eat. And while they were preparing it, he fell into a trance. And so the heavens opened, and something like a great sheet descended, being let down by its four corners upon the earth. In it were all kinds of animals and reptiles and birds of the air. And there came a voice to him, Rise, Peter, kill and eat. But Peter said, By no means, Lord, for I have never eaten anything that is common or unclean. And the voice came to him again a second time, What God has made clean, do not call common. This happened three times that this was taken up to heaven at once.